Hello, my name is Nicholas Santillo. And I'm Shantria Tran. And in this introduction to reporting video, we'll be looking at the three main forms of reports you'll be working with in DHIS2. So the first are pivot tables. Here we have two examples of pivot tables directly out of DHIS2. The first one you can see is pretty standard and quite complex, mm -hmm. and they can be as complex as you need. <laughs> Of course, you can also do something by uh, adding a heat map there where we can color uh, the numbers depending on what we'd like. This is fully customizable in the system yes. and the user interface is quite easy to learn and use. Yes, and as it's showing in, in the chart here, it's very easy to pick up on problem areas mm -hmm. if you do that. Using those heat maps. Secondly, we have graphs. There is a very intuitive graphing app in DHIS2 where you can create multiple graphs very quickly and change their parameters on the fly. Third, we have GIS mapping. And here's an example of a complex GIS map that was used during the Ebola outbreak of 2015. So DHIS2 is very, very capable of tracking information mm. through space. Finally, we have the dashboard where we can collect multiple reports, any type, mm -hmm. and put them together so that a specific user or set of users can see all the information they need on one screen. Right, and we can make many dashboards, you can mm -hmm. see here. Great, the next couple of slides will be a little quiz for you. Good luck. All right, this has been Nicholas Santillo. And Shantari Tram. And thanks so much for watching.